Yo! What's up, everybody? This is your boy Venom back to give you another video. Like how I did that? <laughs> Anyways, guys, today we are going to do a little quick review. Not a completed review, and what I mean by that is uh, it's a game I'm reviewing. I have not completed it. I will at some point when I get around to it. <laughs> I've been busy. But it's. I wanted to get this out there because I have a few gripes with this. And I need to point it out to all you lovers out there. And that is this. Doom for Xbox One. <sighs> Alright. Let me start by saying this. The original Doom. Amazing. Loved it. All the other sequels that followed. Loved all of them. My favorite, honestly was Doom 3. I used to have it for Xbox, and that was the scariest damn game I ever played. And the, the, the story was great, the enemies were great, the game was just scary all the way to the end. It kept you on edge. Freaky ass music. I mean, it was perfect. It was a perfect game. I loved it. All hail Doom 3. So I figured, when a new one came out, even though it's been some time now, since it's been out, uh, I thought the new one would be even more epic. Even more over the top. And then we get this. Now, I could be wrong. Maybe as the game progresses, it gets a little better. Things start getting more interesting. But I'm going to start by saying this. The story is fucking stupid. It don't make any sense. Well, I mean it does, but it's so simplistic that it's it's stunning. There's no thought put into it. It's just a bunch of crap. Here's another gripe I have is the enemies. So far, they're not very imaginative. And not only that, they throw so many enemies at you. Just constant. And I'm playing on a lower difficulty and they're still showering me with enemies. It's a little over the top. And I, I'm all for, you know, destroying enemies, killing them. But it should ramp up as the game goes on farther. The farther you go, the more enemies you take on because you're getting better at it. You're understanding how the world works and how to shoot and how to take down enemies and so on and so forth. But you got your little melee attack. You hit them a few times, you run up and rip their arms off and beat them over the head with it. Yeah, that's nice, but after a while, it gets kind of boring. I don't want to just keep doing that the whole game. This is Doom. We're supposed to fuck shit up. And yeah, I, I get it. They, they give you more enemies to shoot. But after a while, it's, it gets a little overwhelming, and it gets a little boring. Because that's basically what you're doing the whole freaking time. There's no in-between. So far. And, and uh, honestly, it's just not enjoyable. It's not. It doesn't give me the feeling of going on. Here's another issue I have with it. The speed of the game. Your guy moves entirely way too fast. Now for you experts, maybe you like to go super fast, but there should be something to change that. Not all of us like to go at supersonic speed to fight enemies. It makes it a little difficult to shoot people. For, for pros, maybe it would be easier, but for people that are just trying to enjoy the game itself, it's a little frustrating. And the weapons, my god, what the fuck happened now I know you get more as you go on but they just they seem lame they just don't feel good nothing about this game feels good to me it doesn't every time I play it it's just like oh my god it just feels like a freaking chore it doesn't breathe that oomph it doesn't capture the oomph from the third game this would be what Doom 4 I guess I don't know. I'm really disappointed, ladies and gentlemen. I'm really disappointed. I know a lot of people praise this game. They're like, oh my god, it's the greatest thing on God's green earth. Oh my god, we're going to suck its fucking dick. Da, 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 da. Shut the hell up. Stop sugarcoating it. The game is not good. It's got problems. It needs to be fixed. And like I said, maybe the game will get better as it goes on, but it seems like the more I play it, the lamer it gets. It just... Uh, it's a chore. It's a straight up chore. 
I give this an epic fail. I mean, come on. I Maybe they, there was just too much to live up to. Maybe another company is trying something different. But I mean, it's freaking Doom. It's not hard to do. I mean, Jesus, I thought the graphics were going to be super enhanced. I expected it to be over the top. I mean, look at what Doom 3 looked like. That was pretty damn good. And that was for Xbox One. And PC, I guess. But this, it just it looks too cartoony. Everything just kind of generic to me. And then, you know, they, they start the game out where you're going outside on Mars and, you know, all of a sudden you can breathe on out, out, out in space, apparently, now. I know you're wearing a suit, but the last game you go outside you couldn't breathe. You had to get oxygen tanks. This one, they just don't, they, well, whatever, who cares. And it's just, most of it is just so unrealistic. I mean, jumping, I, I remember the, the part where you first go outside, unless there's something else you're supposed to do I didn't notice. But it left you at a spot where there was just like this big jump. You had to take a leap of faith. Right at the beginning of the game. I mean, I thought it was really nuts. So I jumped and landed 200,000 freaking feet below me and I was fine. Which I thought was a little odd. So you don't even know. They don't give you a heads up to that kind of stuff. I don't know. It's just it's a little disappointing. But I will continue on. I will try to beat this. And I will beat this. It's too stupid not to. <laughs> And when I beat it, I'll give you an updated review on this. But for now, Doom is a fail. Anyways, hope I didn't piss everybody off by saying that. But I'm just being honest with y'all because it needs to be put out there. Anyways, give me a like, give me a subscribe, give me some feedback. And until next time, I will see you all again. See you later.